At the Maryland Army National Guard's D Company, 278th Brigade Engineer Battalion, located at the Patuxent River Readiness Center in Maryland, the day begins with pre-flight checks of the V-2 Shadow, an unmanned aircraft system, or UAS, that can be rolled out by just one soldier. When the launch order is given, a slingshot sends the Shadow into the sky. And near the launch site are ground control stations, where soldiers fly the aircraft as part of the day's training mission. On the battlefield, uh, we can do um, you know, real-time surveillance, uh, look at what's taking place on the ground. Um, we can aid troops in contact. Uh, as far as being able to feed that video back to the command center, they can make their decisions from there. Uh, we can do convoy support, um, you know, make sure nothing gets attacked, or if it does, point out where the enemy is, that sort of thing. For natural disasters, the UAS allows for greater coordination of response efforts. The UAS can bring a whole lot for disaster response efforts and the fact that we can monitor ongoing uh, issues on the ground. Um, we're able to direct police, emergency uh, vehicles and things to certain areas with pinpoint accuracy. And keeping the UAS ready for the warfight and disaster response requires ongoing maintenance. And we have uh, daily inspections, we have reoccurring inspections uh, on the aircraft, uh, just regular maintenance like you might do on your automobile, um, air filters, oil filters, that sort of thing. Um, we have to prepare for flight, uh, load fuel into it. It's not as simple as a normal car when you're putting gas in it, uh, but we have to make sure everything's done properly. Uh, from there, we uh, mount it on the launcher, and once we have uh, clearance through tower, uh, we can launch the aircraft. And the importance of UAS missions is never lost on maintainers and operators. The job is, is quite demanding, but at the same time it's extremely rewarding knowing that what you do here, as simple as it seems sitting in a box and watching the ground with a camera, is very important, especially overseas. I've been overseas and I've used this system and I'd like to think at the end of the day that I've saved lives. For National Guard Bureau of Public Affairs, I'm Tech Sergeant Eric Smith.